you know, there's been much talk about the rise of digital currencies and how regulators and central banks are thinking about developing those uh, over a period of time. Uh, what, are the, what are your thoughts over here? Can digital currencies uh, coexist with cryptocurrencies or will there be competition, you think? One may displace the other. You mean the CBDC and, 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 and crypto? That's right. I think it's going to coexist, I mean, especially for Bitcoin. Uh, I think the use case is so much different. I mean, uh, CBDC is uh, is a form of fiat currency. You you pay taxes with it. You 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 make purchases with it. You make payments with it. Uh, whereas uh, for Bitcoin, uh, the primary uh, primarily it's for store of value, so it competes with gold or um, you know is somewhat with uh, the treasury bills not the currency itself. It's not competing against dollars or, or wands or, or weons or, or yens. So I think they're gonna coexist. It's just gonna serve as some sort of a base layer as a store of value um, so that it could be collateralized and applied to some sort of a, a more smart contract based uh, blockchain applications that has uh, more access, like better access to wider uh, variety of people across the globe. Sure. And what about uh, the issue around price volatility? I mean, we've seen what's happened with Bitcoin just because of a tweet from Elon Musk. Well, uh, so I think it's it's a very interesting phenomenon. Um, so, so I guess what happened last February when Elon Musk tweeted that it's uh, they they purchased Bitcoin. Um, so basically, it's like the creed of Elon Musk meeting um, you know the creed of Bitcoin. So it's all I think. Uh, like phenomena of financial populism, which we're pretty much seeing after after COVID, and um, basically what happened very recently after the tweet from Elon Musk is the people that joined the force of Bitcoin have simply left. Uh, but I don't think it has anything to do with the fundamentals of Bitcoin, and I think uh, the fundamental is very very strong, uh, despite what 